Hey there! I'm Orb and welcome back to Homebody. I have gotten two generators, or at least have the ability to activate two generators, and now I think this is all that remains. The only problem is, I don't know what the heck to do with this. However, it did say something broke downstairs, so if I can make my way down there without dying, I can see what that is. What broke downstairs? Also, how far downstairs did it break? Is this the thing that broke? No, I think this was already, always broken. This is a bad place to be. Oh, 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 oh. There's a broken piece of glass on the ground. It looks like there's letters on it, but it doesn't, sp what is it? But it doesn't spell anything. S-T-U-V-W-X-Y-Z. S-T-U-V-W-X-Y-Z. Ah, dang it. S-T-U-V-W-X-Y-Z. S-T-U-V-W-X-Y-Z. You are breathing so loud, Emily. My goodness. Hey, hey, Gary. I keep wanting to call you Cliff. I get them mixed up for some reason. Oh, sorry. I don't remember your name. Megan, that's what it was. Upstairs, 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 upstairs. All right, my face is dissolving. I'm assuming that's good. I don't know what to do here. Because stays all well and good. But it's not the letter I'm looking for. Yeah, this doesn't do anything new. Wait a second. How did I miss this? Okay, so there is an A there. How am I supposed to know the correlation? Okay, I'm assuming all three of these layers are the same except for this. And I'm assuming this implication is that A is 1, and then Z is 1, and then T is 1. And maybe S is one? Ah. I feel like I'm really grasping at straws here. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. This is either some kind of cipher, or I haven't got a clue what this is. Right, I'm just gonna touch a wire real quick. Alright, let's see, if I just go straight up there. First of all, yeah, Emily's just gone forever. You aren't open at all. Okay, so it all starts at 4, is that important? This time it starts at W and D. Why is it starting somewhere different this time? Oh! Oh, wait a minute, wait just a second, wait just one gosh darn second here. X, Y, Z, S, E, F, G, A, X, Y. Let's just take a little gander, I think I just saw something, never mind, it was sparks. How am I doing on this front? Okay, so it's not quite right. So if it starts at W... Y. No. T. A. That was a U. V. W. X. Y. I don't know, let's take a look. I, this is m this may be proving to be less immediately apparent than I was thinking. Oh, I hear the monster doing monstery things. So that's almost at stay. It's either two or one. Whatever it's on right now is what's not on later. Oh, I missed the lightning. Gosh dang it. Eyes here, I hear the monster. Oh, the monster's right there! Hello! Huh. Ah. Right. 
Please tell me you're not coming in. You're coming in here. Oh, good. Oh, great. Oh, wonderful. Oh, you have a face inside your face face. Ah. Uh... That was the face I saw in those paintings that one time. Things have been hard, haven't they? Shut up. So, Emily, do you want to hear a secret? No, I don't want to hear your secrets. Suit yourself. Bye for now. Yeah, goodbye forever. Because I'm totally winning. Is there like some button I'm supposed to press that locks this in? Okay, it's seven apparently. Okay. I thought I cycled through the entire thing, but I guess I was wrong. Now uh, let's just... Can I just uh, take a look at that? 8712, okay. I, I None of those are the numbers I would have expected them to be, but I guess that's fine. Well, might as well die. Yay! Okay. So that combination is sense lightning rod. It looks like this is the thing that's going to gather power from lightning, Frankenstein style. Now, once the lightning strikes, there will be a unit of power for the accumul accumulator. Now I just need to go quickly to the other places. Gotta do the toilet thing. Then I gotta do the other thing to open the door. On. All power on. Once lightning strikes, that is. Then throw the switch, and everything's good! Someone just died. Oh, two people just died. That means he's probably downstairs. Going through the living room and kitchen. Well, you're right there! Well, I guess I was sort of right. You were just on your way down here, then. Lightning rod achievement. Here it is, here it is, here it is. Whoa. Oh, Francine! You are here. I didn't mean to scare you. What are you doing up here? The lamp in the study broke again, and I know you were up here. We need to talk before you do something rash. M. Ugh, there are other things we can do. Other options. I mean, for goodness sake, Emily, look at that thing. Do you really think it can solve all your problems? What other choice do we have? You think you know how to get us out of this? No, Em, I'm telling you neither of us do. Maybe there is no way out. I think I first clocked it when they when you started poking around and solving Ness's little puzzles and talking in code. And for a moment there, I had a glimmer of hope that this was progress for the both of, both of us. That maybe you would help me figure out how to get us out of here. But nope, you're still you're still you. What? But I'm begging you, don't let it come to this. Why trust a weird old man and his weird old machine? Because it's better than dying over and over again. Listen, I don't want this fight to end. I want this to stay ugly because it's something. But we need to get out of here, Francine, one way or another. We don't know what it'll do. It could ruin everything. As if everything wasn't already ruined enough. This could be the end, Emily. Yeah, it could be. Oh, hello! Crap, watch out! Francine! I'm sorry! Okay. Why is it on? Power up and activate the accumulator. Okay. And there I am in the netherverse. Hey Pete, you look angry. Another fine mess you've gotten yourself into. Go to heck. Pete, could you could be pretentious? Pete could be pretentious some. Pete could be pretentious sometimes, but he didn't talk like the gosh darn great Gazo. Gazoo, Gazoo. Ness made it sound like you're not really you. And you're gonna trust him? You took the time to turn on his machine. Look how much good that did you. Seems like it worked out okay. I'm still here. Barely. You couldn't- you can't keep coming back like this forever. Turning on the accumulator almost bled this place dry. I thought the accumulator created this place. 
The accumulator couldn't create crap. It's a wooden box attached to one of those static electricity machines from the science museum. At least it was. The decades of obsession Ness put into it turned it into s into a ticking time bomb. The raw energy of it almost killed this place. So if this place dies, what happened to us? Do we get set free or what? How do you define free? I don't know, reality? A place where I can step outside without warbly brain waves taking over the entire world? And I mean, I don't mean like brain waves like psychokinetic, I mean like it looks like a brain and it's waving. I don't like that. Don't start with me. Truthfully, I don't know. The strength that keeps you here is giving out, but so is the strength that's keeping here here. When that strength is finally gone, I don't know if you're no longer here or if you go out with the rest of what's here. Oh boy. Ugh, if that makes sense. It makes about as much sense as any of the rest of this stuff. I don't think I'm going to be able to talk to you again after this. I don't think I'll ever... I'll be able to do anything after this. I'm not so sure you're a real person. Since there'll be a quiet moment before the thoughts of the house intrudes again, do you have anything you'd like to know? What is the thing that keeps killing us? It's a symptom, a side effect. So are you. Though you have a little more of a sense of self than the homunculus does. Who are you really? <sighs> For all intents and purposes, I'm Pete. Okay, okay. Sure. What happens to you now? I don't know. That's one little... That one's a little beyond me. There's a threshold I'm aware of. I can hear it. I can barely hear anything else. I'm really scared. I'm not ready to cross it. But I don't have any choice. Still, it was good while it lasted. It was nice meeting you. Shucks. For real, why are you helping me? Like I said before, why do you think I would want to hurt you? Because you've had me and my friends trapped in a heckish uh, memory with a meat monster that keeps killing us? I didn't create the house. I didn't create you or the memory or the meat monster. These things just flow through me. I don't want any of this for you. I don't want anything. If you didn't create the killer, who did? Probably me! I don't know. Entropy? What's with all this? these evasive answers? I can't believe Nest was more forthcoming than you. Nest just has a way with words, I guess. Alright, I feel like I'm starting to fade. Time to go to bed. I don't have the choice to not... Oof, I don't have the choice not to bring the house back again. The house, all of you, that night, the gravity of it is too great. Greater than me. Why? I don't know. Seems pretty pointless if you ask me. It's been created and destroyed and recreated before. But this time it takes longer. I don't know how many more times I can it can happen again. Take care. This is, is not the end. Oh boy. Oh dear. Ah, oh, brain waves. Oh. <sighs> Life is a simulation. then let's get this out of the way head injury hey hey I have different hair it's tied back it's not trying I'm not trying to block my eyes anymore I'm um oh is this in the past no no it's not in the past maybe it is in the past I don't know I'm about to head out of town, and I don't want to leave without... without checking on me. Yeah. Do you... want to come in? How's your head? Oh, it's fine. I didn't even end up spending the night. When I got home, I passed out, like, immediately, but I kept waking up. Something about B. 
being told you could die in your sleep really gives you a fitful dreams, you know, you know? Anyway, the doctor said I could sleep, so I've been working at it all day. I got my sleepy time tea. Should be fine. She just said to avoid caffeine and, like, strenuous mental activity, I guess. What, did you get a lobotomy or a concussion? I don't know why I went to lobotomy first. Gosh, Francine, I just wanted to say that I'm, uh... Hold on. Are you here to apologize? You feel sorry? For what? I don't know. I guess I was just watching you falling, and I couldn't help but think I could have done something about it. About what? A fiberglass... <laughs> A fiberglass hot dog collapsed. I got a concussion. It wasn't the end of the world. I really thought the hot dog could hold our weight. I did too. You could have broken your neck. But I didn't. You came with me to the ER. You were there for like three hours. People have... In, people have aneurysms. Something hours late. Sometimes hours later. Oof. People have aneurysms. Sometimes hours later. People hit their heads going up the stairs and die after a week with no warning. I remember you have a. I remember you having be a better handle on this stuff. What's going on? I think I might be experiencing some cognitive decline. What are you talking about? I don't know. I'm just. I think I'm just in town to see some freaking shooting stars or whatever, a meteor shower, and I'm stuck in this part of the process where my friends and I are like strangers. The ice never breaks. I can't get through to anyone. I don't think any of these are going to matter. Oh my gosh, you said it! We find out the house we're trapped in is all made out of meat. Us, in the time loop, and the masked freak with the knife that keeps killing us, all of us, all of it. It's so absurd that I start to think it must not be happening. I assume it just has to end somehow. And it was never real in the first place. But no, there is a masked killer, and some kind of Groundhog Day thing. But then even that isn't true. It's some kind of nasty fake reality we're in. I don't know. I'm like, is there something messed up about me? Did I do something to deserve this? Like, I created that thing, didn't I? I willed it into being. Or is this just in my head? Am I unconscious in a car at the bottom of a ravine? Did I slip in the freaking shower or something? Emily, you can't... The worst thing about all this is I don't even know if anything is special about it. Maybe this is just normal disillusionment. Emily, you're trapped in a time loop and there's a knife-wielding monster that keeps killing us. Ugh, I know. It sucks. But... Something about this night, when I leave, when I left your apartment, whenever the heck this actually happened, I remember the look you were giving me. Like future uncertain anything can happen stuff. And I messed it up. Hermited in myself away and didn't talk to anyone. To you or anyone. I let it all slip. I lost my best friend over nothing. After the night at the hospital, I told myself I wasn't going gonna depend on anyone else ever again. I wasn't gonna caretake or be taken care of. I went all in. All in on me. I went all in. All in on me. And when I saw you again at the Nest's house years a year later, I realized it was working. I guess. I wasn't angry, I didn't feel passionate about not having heard from you. It was just a matter of fact. Well, Francine, you don't have to apologize. I'm not apologizing. I did what was right for me. I decided I wasn't going to give you, or my dad, or my landlord who needs to come inside my apartment for a half hour to tell me he's raising my rent. I decided I wasn't going to give anything more time or thought than I could spare. I did everything I could. I started waking up at 6 a.m. every day, meditating for an hour. I upped my therapy to as many times a week as my insurance would allow. And when I lost that insurance, I found free counseling services and did that as much as I could. I made a full-time job of just trying to be happy, and I'm still not. It wasn't enough to maintain, the yearning's still there. There's a sense that whatever used to make life magical is gone now. You can't remember what it was, so you invent things. It was a video game. Whoops, I clicked my twitchy finger, gosh dang it. 
Or maybe it's a plan you make, some future time where you imagine you'll feel exactly like you used to. The reality is, there, things are changing, but nothing is changing faster than you are. The days are shorter now, and you're in pain, and there's somebody with a knife coming for you. Don't hit your head on the stairs. I'm so gosh darn sick of living in the past. That sounds pretty healthy. Why does it- then why does it hurt so much? Not everything feels good all the time. So... We're not really... Here, are we? I don't think so. All the flashbacks we've been having are all part of the illusion, too. They've all been just a little off, you know? Like that weird sun in the background with the weird red mist that seems to like... I don't know, whoosh over it? I, just, I don't know. It looks vaguely like a guy. Right, the abstract landscapes and the pink flesh monsters in the meat world couldn't all be the memory distortion. Can't all be me memory distortion. It feels good to be able to talk about it. It does. Crap. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, 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 oh. Oh my goodness, are you okay? Nah, nah, it's fine. I'll get a towel. Yeah, start bleeding, bleeding from the head and... Okay. Ow. Yeah, ow. <laughs> Guess it's kind of pathetic that we're able to, to let any of this go, huh? That we weren't able to let any of this go, huh? Yeah, I wonder when this even actually is, the present, I mean. It's sad if this is happening, like, a year after the trip to Ness's house. Way sadder if it's, like, five years later. Or if it's been decades and this is hell. When you're referring to the place, it's okay. Pretty boring hell. We're gonna die in this place, aren't we? Probably. I mean, permanently. For real this time. Oh, the blood is spreading. Probably. Oh! It's still going. Well... That's concerning. In that case, I have no idea what to do next, and I guess I'll have to figure it out next time. Hopefully this isn't a... You have one more chance to do something different. I don't know. Whatever the case is, I'm going to have to leave for, for next time. So thanks for watching. Subscribe if you please, like if you wish. Comment below for, with any games you want to see me play, and I'll see you later. Bye.